Hi friends, it's so good to see you today. Did you know that Jesus is alive? It's true, and Jesus wants to be your friend forever. Let's celebrate and sing to Him. I wanna sing, I wanna shout I wanna tell everybody what I know about I gotta light, I gotta shine It makes me dance and spin around I'm so excited, I just can't hide it I cannot keep it to myself I'm so excited, I just can't hide it I cannot keep it to myself So I throw my hands up
Jesus is bigger and stronger than anything ever. Jesus is alive. Our memory verse from the Bible this month says, I am alive forever and ever. Revelations 1.18. Let's practice that verse together. I am alive forever and ever. Revelation 1.18. I am alive forever and ever. Revelation 1.18. Great job with that verse. Jesus is alive forever and ever, and we can follow him. Tell me, friends, who is alive? Jesus is alive. Yes, Jesus is alive. This is the Bible. Our story today is about someone very, very special, and it comes from the Bible. And this is our pretend palm branch. A palm branch is like a really big leaf on a tree. I'm going to give one to Miss Amy. Thank you. And we are going to wave them in the air during the story. You can pretend to wave a palm branch during the story too. Who? Who? You know what time it is. It's time to hear a story full of wonder. There's so much fun we'll have Each one of us put our favorite things on ours. Let's see, here's Poppy's. It's a rainbow sparkle unicorn. It's a giant chocolate chip cookie. Devin loves chocolate chip cookies. This is Lucy's. It's her favorite thing. It's Lolly, her pet parrot. Those are all super cool things, but mine is the very best. See, I put the moon and sun and stars on it because I love outer space. Houston, Houston, this is Kai. Do you hear me? I love my outer space flower pot and I can't wait to plant these flower seeds in it. Who, who? It's Ollie. Hello, Kai. Who, who? Got your head in the stars, do you? Hi, Ollie. Look at my special flower pot. I'm going to put dirt inside and plant these seeds. What a beautiful pot. Who, who? I know something even more special for you. So let's hear this story. Just follow me through. Who, who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? Ollie's got a Bible story for me and you. Okay, just a little more water. There we go. Oh, <laughs> hi, friends. Stormy Jane, it's our friends. Right. Hi, everybody. I'm Carrie, and this is my best dog, Stormy Jane. We were just doing a little gardening, making sure everything looked nice, because today is a very special day, celebrating someone really special. It's Palm Sunday. <laughs> Stormy Jane loves Palm Sunday. I think we should tell them the story. What do you think, Stormy? Stormy, where are you going? Oh, you got a palm branch. Smart dog. You need a palm branch if you want to tell the Palm Sunday story. Hey, do you have your palm branch? Raise it high. Let's wave it around. <laughs> okay, let's tell the story. Palm Sunday started in the city of Jerusalem, and it was like any other Sunday. The townspeople were all going about their normal day until someone announced that Jesus was coming to town. They were so surprised and so excited. They had heard of Jesus and that he can do anything. He made a storm stop just by saying stop. They had heard that he made sick people better and that he could feed a whole group of people with only a little bit of food. Yay, Jesus! Everybody wave your palm branches. Jesus can do anything. He is so special. And if he was coming to town, then they needed to do something special to celebrate him. So some people got palm branches 
and some took off their coats and laid them in the street to give Jesus a special place to ride. And then they saw him. He was here. They waved their palm branches. Let's wave our palm branches, ready? And then they shouted, Hosanna, Hosanna, yay, Jesus. Can you say that? Try it. Hosanna, Hosanna, yay, Jesus. Again, Hosanna, Hosanna, yay, Jesus. The people were celebrating Jesus because they knew he was so special. Everyone was so excited for Jesus to be there. Moms and dads and grandparents and teachers and children, they were celebrating Jesus. Let's celebrate him too. Wave your palm branches. Jesus is so special. And Jesus is alive today and loves when you and me and all of us celebrate him. So one more time, all together, let's say Hosanna, Hosanna, yay Jesus, as loud as we can. Are you ready? One, two, three. Hosanna, Hosanna, yay Jesus. <laughs> hey there, Ollie. Ollie, tell me, who is alive? Jesus is alive. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who is alive? Jesus is alive. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Happy Palm Sunday. <laughs> Bye. So there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus is super special, so we can all celebrate. You and me, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow, Jesus is so amazing and special. We can all celebrate him. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Get it? Got it. Good. I think my flower pot is pretty special, but Jesus is even more special. I can't wait to get planting and see these flowers grow. See you guys next time. Bye. Hosanna, Hosanna, yay, Jesus. Hosanna, Hosanna, yay, Jesus. The people were celebrating Jesus because they knew he was very special. And we still celebrate Jesus on Palm Sunday because Jesus is alive and he wants to be our friend forever. So when I ask you who is alive, I want you to say Jesus is alive and wave those palm branches in the air. Ready? One, two, three. Who's alive? Jesus, Jesus is, is alive. alive. Again? Who is alive? Jesus, Jesus is, is alive. alive. Okay, friends, it's time to close our eyes and talk to God. So make sure your palm branches are very quiet. Dear God, we are so excited that Jesus is alive and that we can celebrate him just like they did a long time ago on the very first Palm Sunday. Thank you for sending Jesus to be our friend forever. Help us remember that we can say Hosanna, Hosanna, yay Jesus, every day. We love you, God. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay, friends, your challenge this week is to turn on some praise and worship music and sing along while waving your palm branches. Be creative and create or find something to use as a palm branch. Now you did a great job posting last week. Grown-ups, again this week, we need you to take a photo or a video of your child doing this challenge and post it either to Instagram or Facebook. Make sure you tag hashtag Victory Kids Lakeland for a chance to win an egg hunt basket complete with everything that you're going to need to have an egg hunt in your very own home. We love seeing all the pictures and videos from our Victory Kids each week, and we can't wait to see all of you praising Jesus this week from home. That's it for our time together today. We're gonna see you next time. Bye. Bye.